What happened in the relationship or what happened in your, in your, in your timeline here where Tony Ferguson comes in and how does Tony Ferguson come into your life out of everybody? A guy who is going after McGregor and seems like that whole world's going crazy on Twitter. Yeah, that was random. You know, it was when I first went to Wildcard. I was just training one day because I, I grew up watching UFC, you know, and so I was training there one day and I was like, fucking Tony Ferguson, like, just rolling around the ground with the Wildcard. I was like, this is a boxing gym. That's why I wasn't sure it was him. I knew, but I like, <laughs> what was he doing? He, the fellow was just like warming up. He was like rolling around, doing whatever. I don't know. But his warm ups are fucking like an hour long. <laughs> his warm ups are like an hour long, but the man's like doing everything. And I was like, is that Tony Ferguson, man? I was unsure. And then, uh, Next day I went, I was like, that's definitely him. Did he have his sunglasses on while he was walking? <laughs> no, nah, no, nah, I definitely would have known him same then. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, so uh, I'm always trying to train as, as hard as I can. You know, I'm trying to train heavy, like harder than anybody in the gym. So I seen Tony, I was like, fuck it. You know, I knew that he was known for his crazy training. So I was like, fuck it, I'm going to try to keep up with him you know, while, while we're training. And uh, he started to notice and then we were both training very hard. And then he was like, just asked me to go for a run one day and we were running. And, and then, you know, we just, we just started training together and all the time. Like sparring or just training? Just and training, just training. Because yeah, you know, Tony don't spar. You should, spar you should talk him to spar back. I sparred with him a few times just late, boy. He doesn't, he doesn't really spar at all. No, no, yeah. But a lot of people don't spar either. Really? Max, Max Holloway doesn't spar either. Sure, he, doesn't. he don't? I don't think so. I think I heard him say something like he don't spar. Yeah. So the relationship with Tony is Tony said that he saw something in you. He said that he saw that you could be a, a champion. He saw that you you had that dog in you. Is that true? Is that what happened? Yeah, so he actually, he was the one that told me. So I didn't know whether I was going to go to the Olympics or I was going to go home and try to go to the Olympics or I was going to turn pro. And I was out with Tony one day and he was like, you just have to make up your mind, man, and just go for go for one of them, you know, just just commit 100% to one of them. And he was like, if you want to go pro, stay here, go pro. If you want to be an amateur and go to the Olympics, go do that. And I was just like, yeah, you know what? I'm here now, I might as well just turn pro. So I'm just going to commit to turning pro. And that's when I decided, you know, after, after Tony told me, he was like, just, just pick one. 